I'm at Toronto Pearson International Airport, waiting for my flight to Frankfurt, Germany, and then transferring to Basel, Switzerland. Maple syrup is so expensive here. This tiny little leaf-shaped bottle is 16 Canadian dollars. For that at Costco, you can get a huge glass one, or a one liter one. Do not buy it at the airport. Okay, so I bought one, oh, I bought two for 15 and it's two for 15 here too. So I guess it's the same price, whether it's Amazon or at the airport. I looked at all the passengers in the Frankfurt flight and none of them are Asian. Mostly white people with a few somewhat darker skinned people, but I might be the only Asian passenger. I bought ice wine as a gift to take. It's an expensive sweet wine. It costs $40 for a tiny slim bottle. Here at the airport, they're selling it for at least $80 for the same size. So double the price or even higher. Oh my gosh, don't buy it here. A little fun fact about ice wine. You harvest them from frozen grapes and you can only get one droplet from one grape. So that's why it's so sweet and expensive. I landed in Frankfurt, Germany. Time to transfer to Basel, Switzerland. Gotta wait a couple hours. Yogurts and fruits. You don't really get that many of that in Toronto. Some beer and lots of sandwiches. Guess Germans like their sandwiches. It was a good thing I didn't eat anything on the flight. I started throwing up gas at the very end while we were descending. And it was mostly gas and a little bit of acid that was hurting the back of my throat as it came out. Just a tiny bit of vomit. Oh man, if I, imagine if I ate, and there was no barf bag, I had a cup only. Imagine if I ate all the food that they gave me, that would have been a lot of food to throw up. So, so glad that I didn't eat. Vancouver is like a five hour flight oh, yeah. from yeah. Toronto. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty far from here. Yeah. Going up the stairs for a plane. Washroom in Basel, and look at this. You use your foot to open the door. That's pretty cool. In Basel, you can exit one way, and it's Switzerland, and another way, and it's France. Okay, rented the car. Little travel tip don't make my mistake and buy insurance online. Buy insurance if you need it when you get to the rental place. So, whew, I think I wasted some money probably, and it's more of a hassle if anything happens, but. It all worked out, got the car, time to drive to Niels' place.
Alrighty, first time driving in a foreign country. At least it's on the same side of the road. I didn't even need the international driving permit. I wasted like 50 something bucks for that. Apparently you don't even need it. Uh, so, oh well, I know it for next time. You don't need it if you're a Canadian and you're driving in Germany or Switzerland. Here we go, baby. I arrived safely at Neil's house, made it in one piece. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Another pet to show in my daily vlogs. <laughs> huh? Oh, is this Flip or is this? It's Snoofy. 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 Man, this homemade goulash is so good. <laughs> wow, so nice. We are walking towards that tower in the background. Nice bird song. Let's take a listen. And we made it to the tower. Came all the way from there. And even closer. Pretty tall. If you go left, it's Switzerland. If you go right, it's Germany. Switzerland, Germany. Okay, here's Paul having a lot of fun <laughs> on a trampoline. This is my first morning in Germany. I slept so well because I was so tired and jet lagged. I just wanted to say one thing, which is that after I rented the car and I was driving to Niels's house, I noticed that the lights, obviously they turn yellow before they turn red, but they also turn yellow before they turn green to give you a warning that, hey, it's about to turn green, so get ready. And I thought that was such a brilliant idea. Like, why don't they do this in North America? That's such a simple thing and yet it, I have no idea why they don't do it in North America. We should learn from Europe in that way. Niels and I haven't really decided what to do today because it's going to be a bit rainy and cold, so might go for a walk once the rain clears up, but other than that, might just take it easy today. But I'll see you tomorrow. Tega Miss you Watch it